Go on inside. Bonnie's waiting. Hey, I guess you're starting your day with me. We're loading magazines. Well, that's it. You got it. I suppose I owe you an apology. I wasn't truthful when I came across y'all at the lodge, and I was shown a kindness I never would have expected from a group of strangers. But now folks are dead, and I can't help but feel I'm to blame. But the plan was for no one to get hurt. Carver's the one who pulled the trigger. He's to blame. Yeah, but I surely didn't help matters. I thought if I was the one that found everyone, I could control it. Keep everyone safe. But that ain't how it went. I apologize. Which don't account for much, but it's all I can offer right now. How was your first night in the yard? I know it ain't so comfortable. You mean my first night in prison? It ain't a prison. More of a work release. Didn't they do those in prisons? Well, I... probably. I don't know. I've never been to prison. Don't tell no one. Trying to keep a tough reputation. I was supposed to go. When Luke and Carlos and all them left, I was planning on leaving too. When Luke approached me about it, I, I thought he was crazy. But you attacked them instead? Hey, I didn't attack anyone. Bill did all that. I didn't want... I wasn't expecting any of that to happen. I just wanted everyone to be safe. Out there ain't exactly all flowers and rainbows. I justified not going by telling myself it's easier to try and change something that's broken than start all over. Take the situation with the herd? That's the type of thing that rips a community apart. He keeps things in line. He's got a lot of this stuff figured out. Herds have come through before? Yeah. It's happened a few times. We've always come out on the other end, all right. It's something I think about whenever I consider leaving. I mean, it ain't easy keeping a group this big fed and protected. I don't envy that position. Figured that'd make anyone a little stressed. I'm not defending what he did. That was... <sighs> I'm alive because of him. That's just a fact. He killed Walter and Alvin. Only to protect his own people. Kenny could have killed us all. But he didn't. Alvin killed George when he escaped. He might not have meant to, but George died all the same. Ain't no saints in all this. Bill overreacted. He was in the heat of the moment, and he overreacted. Luke had ideas about how things should go, but they didn't line up with what Bill was thinking. They butted heads, then Rebecca started showing, and that only made things worse. Maybe Luke was right about him. I wish he was around, but I just hope he's safe. Hey, Bonnie, is that girl down there? I need to come get her. Yeah, she's here. Okay, I'll be right over. I'm sure it's fine. Oh, almost forgot. I grabbed this for you. Huh? What do you think? I found it at the lodge y'all were at. Think it might be for skiing. Had to wait for no one to be around to get it to you. It's kinda ugly. Really? I thought it was kinda cute. Well, this ain't a fashion show. It'll keep you warm. You better watch yourself. I think some folks might be jealous of that cool jacket of yours. Oh, there you are. What's with the ugly jacket? Tavia! What? Never mind. I'll see you later, Clementine. Come on. That wasn't his problem. He was weak of will, and weak of character. And we can't have that around here. Not anymore. You're a murderer. You can try and call it something else. But I know what it is. What it really is. Listen, Clementine. It ain't murder. You see, Reggie put us at risk with his incompetence. He's had a string of screw-ups lately. Killing one in order to save many is part of survival. 
It's one of the tough decisions that a weaker person couldn't make. It's why it falls to people like us to lead them to safety. Do you understand? Well, I wish it was different, I do. But they are weak, and we are strong. That's why it's our responsibility to shepherd the flock, to keep them safe. It's their nature to follow, not to lead. I'm not like you. I know it when I see it. And we're more alike than you think. In fact, I think you realize it, but you're not comfortable with it yet. There's no way you could have lasted this long otherwise. I realized it back in that cabin. You were scared, but you looked me straight in the eye, kept your nerve. That's what we need if we're gonna get through this. The next generation has to be stronger than the last to lead us out of this. Kids like you, raised the right way, the way my child will be raised. It ain't this herd that keeps me up at night. We can handle that. What if it's not yours? Well, even if that was true, it's mine now. All right, now. Bill, you there? Yeah, I'm here. The loading bay door is jacked. Troy really knocked the shit out of it. How bad is it? Rails are tweaked so it won't shut all the way. I don't think it's an emergency or anything, but it's something Stan should take a look at when he can. I'll get him on it. Out. That fucking idiot. Heard on its way, and he puts a goddamn ding in my door. Go on back out to the yard. It's almost supper time. You wanna disrespect me? Fine. You wanna throw away the life I'm trying to build for us all? Then fucking fine! Wanna run off with this dog shit group of crippled fucks? Then fine. Be my guest. But I will put a bullet in you. Get back! Come on, Luke. This ain't none of your business. This is just a bit of a custody battle we got on our hands here. Shoot him. Just shoot him. What? No, I got- and wait outside. We have to go. Kenny, please. I only need a minute. Go on. You don't need to see this. That girl's already seen more than you can imagine. Shut your mouth, Bill. You're all just gonna let him do this? I'm not going anywhere. It's gonna get messy. I know. Look at you, you fucking ingrates. I don't even know how good you got it. That's all right. You'll learn. Lambs to the slaughter. No shepherd to guide you. Clementine knows exactly what I'm talking about. No, I'm not letting you see this. It's not your decision. Atta girl. She ain't afraid to look it in the eye. You go with that feeling you got right now, Clementine. That's what makes you stronger than Come the rest on. of them. Let's go. Yeah, go on. Let the sheep out of the pen. We'll see how long that lasts. I'll be right there. You won't see anything. That's funny. Coming from you. How's that I? Just follow my voice. It'll get you there. You got a thick fucking skull, Kenneth. Should have put you out of your misery right then. Now look at you. You're a mess. The fuck are you looking at, bitch? Don't act like you didn't love every second of it. <laughs>
Let's go. 